Yeah, I realize it's been a minute or so since I've uploaded, and I apologize for that. I'm sure all 10 or 11 of you are absolutely chomping at the bit for more material. But uh, for the past week and a half, close to two weeks now, the house has been completely inundated with work that's been taking place both under the house and in the attic, taking care of humidifiers and cleaning out the attic above so it's constant drilling and people walking through the attic so there's been very little if any time for me to record without constant work going on throughout the day and it's it's just been a hassle to say the least so I've just decided to wait until all that was finished and it's much easier to record during the day than late at night when everyone else is asleep for obvious reasons. But that being said, I wanted to kind of check in with everyone and just basically kind of give a heads up as to what the actual purpose of this channel is. And I don't think I've really stated at all at this point, but the truth be told is, is that, and I, I might have actually stated it, in my very first video but I kind of want this channel to be sort of an everything channel not really tied down or bound to any one particular style of content or subject I really enjoyed doing what I was able to do with my grandmother and cooking with her because you know she's she's in her 80s now and at the risk of sounding a little morbid or bleak you know it's anyone who can count knows that once you're at that age you only have a certain amount of time left and I would never be able to forgive myself if I didn't start chronicling as much of that time as I possibly could because she is an absolute angel I've always loved her with all of my heart and everything that comes out of her mouth is an absolute gem and spending time with her is genuinely fun and I really do enjoy it and so being able to not just cook with her but just spend time with her and chronicle it and record it all and have it in some kind of permanent format is important to me because I want it to be able to live on in perpetuity and be able to show to everyone just how amazing of a human being she truly is and the same extends to my grandfather as well because he's a truly interesting individual as long as you don't get him on the subjects of religion or politics or anything like that because i mean he's also in his 80s so you can let your imagination fill in the rest but beyond that he's he's a genuinely wise and interesting individual to talk to and I want to do the same with him as much as I possibly can both of them I want to chronicle as much as I possibly can with both of them before it's too late and beyond that there's a lot of other things that I would really like to do with this channel traveling and you know going and doing fun things with with me and my husband Jacob L like for instance the one of the more recent videos I did with me showing him trying to conquer his fears and so far being doing quite a good job at conquering his fears of heights and one of his other fears being swimming or deep water and I've been teaching him how to swim not so much now that it's started to get colder, but still, the point remains the same. Doing as much as I possibly can with him is genuinely fun. And he's never, this is the first time he's ever been this far southeast because he just recently moved down here. So, this whole area of the United States is completely new to him. Like just earlier today, it was a nice day out, so we went to Birmingham and he hadn't seen downtown Birmingham like five points Birmingham so we just went out there for a little while and just kind of walked around 
and it's a nice part of town and we we just kind of spent a majority of the early day just exploring and he really enjoyed it and i wish i would have recorded it because it, it was just really interesting to gauge his reactions on a lot of these things and i plan on doing a lot of that from now on is recording a lot of the things that me and him do together especially when it involves traveling to places around here with him which most of the things that i do involve doing with him because i mean he we live together and i mean we're effectively attached at the hip and so yeah i mean but beyond that as well i i've always had a deep fascination and love for cars and i've always wanted to get into that realm of things but from everything that I've ever seen, at least on YouTube at least, it, that generally requires a fair amount of money to kind of insert yourself into that realm. Unless all you're doing is simply visually reviewing cars from a distance or at least from your computer, which is possible, but everyone knows that the better version of that content is to do it firsthand in person reviewing cars or test driving cars or like supercars and things like that or restoring old cars and things like that and that requires a lot of money or knowing the right people neither of which i have or know but i've always had a enormous amount of desire to do both of those things because i've always loved cars i've always been a massive fan of cars and I've always wanted to get into that same for racing I've just always loved it and that's that's all there is to that I mean I've always wanted to be a professional race car driver I've wanted to since I was a kid but of course my my family my parents always rejected that idea about as much as they rejected uh, me being a musician they were just like, no, it's too expensive. You you know, you'll get yourself killed. Or in the music's case, no, it's a dead end career. There's no point in you doing that and you'll just give up on it. Of course, here we are 17 years later and I still play bass. Don't have a functioning career at it, but hey, I still love doing it. And I'm, if to at the risk of tooting my own horn, I'm pretty damn good at it. But be that as it may, it's it's just one of those types of things where there's a lot I want to do with this channel. Most importantly, I want to be able to help other people. And I, I not only that, I want to get myself and my husband into a better place, a better state of living. And that's going to require a lot of help. And it's not going to come from my family whatever whatever level of success or wealth my family has had or does still have has seldom ever extended to me i've always had to work for what i have and fight for it and i'm proud of that but when it comes to this i'm very much on my own and that's something i'm painfully aware of even if i were to be working a nine to five or multiple nine to fives getting myself and Jacob into a house of our own or a better living situation period would take years and I do mean multiple years because Alabama for as beautiful of a state as it is and for as nice as the people are here it's not exactly the um, wealthiest state or has the um, best pay rates for jobs in case anyone needed clarification on that though i don't think that needed clarification it's one of those things to where i do want to help other people and not just myself and my husband i want to help other people in general not because not for the sake of clout or like recognition or anything like that simply because I've always enjoyed doing it and beyond that it's the right thing to do 
And the sad fact of the matter is, is that right now I don't have the ability to do it, but I would like to. And the sooner I have the ability to do that, the better. And it's just the truth. And I don't think I need to say that for it to be obvious, but you never know with people on the internet. Because there are plenty of people around here that I've grown up with that deserve success and deserve to be in a better place in life. And yet, because of circumstances beyond their control, they're not able to be in the position that they deserve to be in because they are truly good people. And I want to be able to help them and to lift them up to the places that they deserve to be. And not just people that I've grown up with, people in general. Like there, there's a pretty rampant homeless, homelessness problem around this state. It's not at near as bad as say like Atlanta or other major metropolitan cities, but it still exists. And I've always enjoyed helping other people in any situation like that whenever and wherever I can. And if I had the ability to help people in that sort of way, I absolutely would. But like I said before, right now, I simply don't have the ability to or the means to, but I want to. And as soon as I'm able to, I will. And that's another thing that I would like to be able to document in any sort of way whatsoever. And just be able to show that, you know, these people are getting the help that they do deserve and are getting lifted up to the levels of success that they do deserve. And that's just always something that I've wanted to do long before I ever started this YouTube channel. Because there are people that I'll see every day, including people, like I said, that I've grown up with, went to middle school, high school with, college with, that you know, started out in a pretty good place and then for reasons either beyond their control or through poor choices when they were teenagers or early in their 20s that, you know, just bad decisions, that they ended up in a really bad place and now they can't undo it because they either don't know how or they don't have the financial means to. And if I had the ability to help them out of those positions, I absolutely would because they are good people and they don't deserve to be where they are. They deserve to be in better positions. You know, no one, I, I feel like no one truly deserves homelessness or deserves to be poor by what people define as poor. And when I say poor, I, I do genuinely mean poor you get what I'm saying. Like, that is one of the core parts of what I want this channel to be. Is not just, you know, traveling around and documenting it, documenting it and, you know, documenting time with my grandparents and, you know, cooking and, and things like that or playing games, which I do enjoy doing all of those things. And I do want to do all of these things. It's just right now, I don't really have the means to do all of those things or the financial ability to do all of those things. Some of these things, yes, I can absolutely do from right here at home and it's, it doesn't cost me a dime like sitting here doing like a let's play or something like that or just re reacting to something that's been going on that, that doesn't require anything, you know, that's all it takes is time and that's free on my end. But beyond that, I mean, there, there are certain things that do just legitimately require money on my end to, say, help someone get into a better position or, you know, travel somewhere or even, even with like Let's Plays, like new games that are coming out, like I'm not always going to have the money to just buy the newest game that's coming out. And that sucks, you know? because that's just how it is. But that's part of what I want this channel to be is kind of an everything channel because I want to be able to go out and explore 
and take my husband with me and us be in a good position to where we can also help other people at the same time and get people that we know and people that we come across along the way up into better positions as well because they deserve it you know they're good people you know why wouldn't they deserve it and so this is just kind of one of those things i i realize that i'm getting kind of off on a tangent but it's just kind of one of those things where i you know i kind of wanted to give everyone an update and kind of a heads up on why i've been gone for so long and you know what i want to do here with this channel and what my ultimate end goals are because it's not just one goal it's many goals uh and it's a lot it, it is certainly a lot to try and accomplish with this channel and i do ultimately intend on achieving the majority of these things if not all of them but you know it's just going to take time but that's pretty much where i wanted to end things and i don't want to ramble for too long so yeah i'll just kind of leave it at that hope everyone enjoys and i hope you all stick around for more thanks